Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to perfect lipstick, especially in close-ups like this one. Let's get right into it. First, you're going to create a new layer. And then we're just going to zoom in a little bit more. And basically, the only two tools we're using are the stamp tool and then later on a little bit of dodge and burn. So you, with the control and the alt key, you can toggle the brush and make it bigger and smaller. And then with the alt key, you're just gonna sample one of the like really filled in red parts of the lips and then click and just paint right over the not so full edge like this. So let's zoom out and look at it before and after. All right, so as you can see, the edge is pretty straight now besides those outward things and that's what we're gonna take care of next. So you're gonna basically do the same thing as we just did, but from the outside. So you're gonna make your brush a little smaller, sample from above the lip and then paint right along that line so we have a sharp edge. All right, so as you can see, the line looks pretty good. Up here, there's something that's bothering me, so I'm gonna go over that one more time. And then I've noticed that you can really see like the pattern here. You can change that up if you want, like right here, we have a little bit of a pattern going on too, and that doesn't look too natural. So yeah, just remove that if it bothers you, then look at the before and after. So now we have a sharp edge besides here. Just noticed one more thing. Okay, so then we're going to use the patch tool, which is over here, and we're going to go along the edges and kind of fluff out the line that we created with the stamp tool. Next thing that we're going to do is actually create a little bit of a better shape, and we're going to go to filter and liquify. That that will open up a new window and you're just going to use this first tool up here um, set the pressure to around 30 to 50 i'm just going to keep it on 40 for now and then we're going to perfect the shape so whenever you drag with this tool it will go this direction and we're just gonna smooth everything out a little bit So the next thing that we're gonna do is dodge and burn. Set our opacity and flow both to 50, sample a dark red color and then paint over the edge so that everything has like the same hue. And yeah, basically that's it. The last step that I would do is sharpen the image. That's a little bit more complicated though, so I'm not gonna go into that, but basically this is how you create a perfect lipstick.